you can change patches with sx series of keyboards create an expansion pack in your expansion manager i named it as moses main stage and in that create an empty uh, normal voices and uh, only 128 of them can be created now we need to check bank select number it's double zero seven in my case it might be different for you just we need to remember in your keyboard open midi setting and select preset select midi off and in transmit only select write 3 and uh, select port 1 channel 1 I assign right 3 to main stage. Now we need to save MIDI preset. I already saved here so I won't be saving it again. Export your pack in Yamaha's expansion manager and install it. After installing your pack into your keyboard, select write 3, go to user, then expansion and the folder which I created is Moses main stage, yeah. so make sure everything is right. Now in main stage, select a patch and in attributes, select bank select and program change in bank select msb should be 64 for all the patches as 64 is the instrument number for uh, yamaha's keyboards lsb should be 007 plus 1 that is 8 my main stage numbers go from 1 to 128 not 0 to 127 do this for remaining patches set program change number According to your wish, I like to put it in a sequence. When you select normal voice 001, it goes to program change number 001 on your main stage. And also you can save this into your registration bank in any order. This is how I change patches. I assign live knob 1 to aux input. If you want to use inbuilt tones in right 1 and right 2, you can do it. But right 3 is not recommended because main stage sound also comes in. This is an inbuilt sax, I put it in right 1. Important step is to create a main stage uh, empty channel and uh, assign right trace volume to that fader. If you do not do this, all the channel strips volumes get changed. That's all. This is how I use main stage in my SX700 keyboard.